We are exploring. Today, Louisiana Purchase State Park near Holly Grove, Arkansas. That is about 15 miles from Brinkley, Arkansas. I bet you've heard of that town. It's about a quarter mile down here on this gravel road, gravel Arkansas State Highway 362, until it ends in the parking lot of the state park. There's one picnic bench here and you can see that this state park is not a very busy place. There's a boardwalk coming up that's going to lead us through a swampy area. That's going to be pretty interesting. Louisiana Purchase Historic State Park. All right, let's go and have a closer look at this. So now you may be wondering, what has Louisiana to do with a place in the center of Arkansas? And while we're walking along this boardwalk, I'm going to tell you this story. In 1682, French explorer René Robert Cavalier Sieur de la Salle undertook a canoe expedition. Here is an informational plate, information plate about the park. De la Salle went on a canoe expedition on the Mississippi River all the way from the Great Lakes in what's now Illinois down to the mouth of the Mississippi River in the Gulf of Mexico that's now Louisiana. Here is another info plate about the swamp and its wildlife and here's an overview of how this looks like. Now after De La Salle had arrived at the Gulf of Mexico, he claimed all the land west of the Mississippi River, drained by the Mississippi River, for France, and named it Louisiana after the then King of France, Louis the Fourteenth. Here's an info plate about the Louisiana Territory. But this is far more than what's known as Louisiana now. This reached from the Canadian border down to the Gulf of Mexico, covering about one third of the land that the United States of America covers now. Here you see how high the water is at points. You see these dark areas at the bottoms of these trees and here wildlife wildlife in the swamp and there we go here is my new friend the turtle that looks pretty neat and all these green algae and its shell is covered by these algae it has yellow cheeks how cute now about two-thirds of the land of the United States are almost 830,000 square miles. In 1803, the United States politicians got sort of bothered that so much land was owned by the French in the United States and they purchased, this, purchased the land from the French for $15 million, which translates to $18 per square mile. What we see here is a hollow tree. There's a plaque next to it that speculates about the reason these trees are hollow. I can tell you what. How this happens is when a tree is struck by lightning and the moist inside of the tree starts boiling and expands and pops the tree open. And proof that I'm right is that oftentimes, very often, you can see charred areas on the inside of these hollow trees.
there we go the hollow tree what we see next is the centerpiece of this park of Louisiana of the Louisiana Purchase State Park and we're almost there we're at the end of this boardwalk and there it is this marker was erected in 1926 and the text reads this stone marks the base established November 10th 1815 from which the lands of the Louisiana Purchase were surveyed by United States engineers. The first survey from this point was made to satisfy the claims of the soldiers of the War of 1812 with land bounties. It's surrounded by swamp. I hope you enjoyed watching this video as much as I enjoyed making it.